Okay, in this video, we're going to see how to make an electronic signature with PowerPoint. Well, you can follow the process with even Microsoft Word and Excel as well, because the process is the same for the, the, the software. Okay, right here, you can see a contract here, and there's something written here, and here is supposed to be Mr. Albert's electronic signature. So, Mr. Albert does not know how to do an electronic signature. What he does is he takes a picture of his signature, and then he tries to put it in here. So, the way it's going to look like is, let me just put in, insert the picture here. There you go. This is what Mr. Albert is trying to do. Is he took a picture, and he rotates it, and then he uh, tries to shrink it down in size and then put it right about there now this is extremely unprofessional as you can see that the signature is not clearly seen and you can also see the background where the photo was taken okay so now mr alvar is unsatisfied with it and he said uh, he tells someone to fix it so what the person does is they insert the picture the same way mr alvar did they put it in here there you go now this time they're a little bit smarter so what they do is they're going to rotate it and then they're going to crop it just like that okay so they're going to crop it so that the only signature can be seen and nothing else but the signature can be seen there you go they have cropped it and now what they do is they give it to mr alware and what mr alware does is puts it right there the signature right there but as you can see this is still not professional very professional because uh this kind of looks like someone who's a noob who has done that is a noob and uh the other drawback of it is that for some reason if the printing actually pushes your picture down because of the margins then the uh, initials of mr alvar here will get the uh, is going to be blocked or it's going to be covered up by the entire picture that is here. So what we need is a transparent picture that will uh, look like that Mr. Alvar has put in his signature on the paper, not on some picture, on some other paper, then took a picture of it and put the picture here. He put his signature on this particular piece of paper that we are seeing here, this blank page, right? So that's what we're going to try to make the signature to look like into. Okay, to do that, we're going to uh, select the picture and then we're going to go to picture format from here We're going to go to color and choose this one, which is uh, black and white 50% If you choose this one now, this looks like a signature that has been given right here or an electronic signature a proper electronic signature But the problem still remains because if you bring it out You can see that the background is still there and if you if you put it here It's okay, but for the printing reasons if this goes downward you can see that the name mr Alvar the initials are still not there so we're going to make uh, this thing go away, the background go away. In order to do that, we're going to go back to color. And from here, we're going to take set transparent color and then click on the background color right over here. Click it there. And now if you bring it out, you can see that it is transparent. You can put it right here. And it is this electronic signature. Now, for some reason, if the image is moved downwards while printing, you can see the initial Mr. Alvar is still being seen and if someone looks at it, they're just going to think, oh, the signature just got over the initials or if it goes down a little bit like that, you can still see Mr. Alvar. But in the previous case, you were not being able to see Mr. Alvar even if it got a little bit downward. Okay, so this is the proper way of giving an electronic signature that we have just learned now how to save this electronic signature because you're not going to uh, sign your powerpoint documents you're most probably going to be signing the pdf documents so to do that you're just going to need to save it as a picture you just do a right click on it and then go to save as picture and then save it on the location that you want to save it uh, on any location that you want okay so once you save it there, this is going to be your uh, electronic signature and then you can put it in your PDF documents as well. Okay, so that is how you can make a proper electronic signature in PowerPoint and this process works for Microsoft Word and Microsoft Excel as well. Okay, so that is it for this video. Thank you very much for watching and I hope you got to learn something new. If you have found the video to be useful, please like and consider subscribing to the channel as it will enable me to make more videos like this one. Thank you.